All right, all right, guys. I'm gonna show you how to use brute force. So I got it right here. This is a save. You put it in here. You click on it. You click on this, and you click on all. And you click yes. Yeah, so we're turning green. So it's ready to go into the Gib Save Editor. Then you just click open. You find your desktop. Here's your game save. You click on this. Make sure you click on PS3. And then you open it. See, it will say level one. So you can like get rid of this. Let's get rid of that. I got like five stuff in my backpack. Go on character. And then you can say bit 72. Sync this in. You can put it at OP8. So you can scan it. So here's a rifle, says level one, and we click scan. Oh, you can see it will go back um, to your OP8 level and all that great stuff. And then here, here's the, here's the ammo stuff. So you just copy and you just copy this, you just copy this. You just, you just copy it. Then you go to the raw thing. See so yeah, this one. Go to the black market. Yeah, delete all of this. It's kind of hard. It's kind of hard when you went out of mouse. Hold on, let me get my mouse real quick. Gotta unplug my USB, guys. Sorry about that. There we go. <clears throat> Alright, got my mouse, guys. I got my mouse. Alright, there we go. And then we go down for the skill tree. Here's the skill tree. Let's open this. So here's the skill tree right here. And then this is how you mod the skill tree, guys. It's really, it's really simple. Really simple to do. Um, and then let's, let's keep doing keep doing this. This takes it takes a minute to mod characters. You know, take some time, guys. Take some time. You know, yeah, it's a lot of skill trees, you know, to go through. Uh, if if you have a Mechromancer, don't you don't want to do all the skill tree except for one, because you won't be able to shoot the Finny pistol with her. If you put on smaller, lighter, faster, like the skill points on it. So be warned, you won't be able to shoot the Finity Pistol if you want the full, full skill tree for the Macromancer. But I don't put it on smaller, lighter, faster for when I mod my Macromancer. Probably did. I've already, I'm gonna probably put the skill points, you know. This is just a video how to use Brute Force and Gibbs Save Editor. Uh, where is that smaller, lighter, faster? Yep, and there it is. Just leave that one to zero, so you can be able to use that that finity pistol. Here, here's that. You know, here's the ammo I was talking about. Uh, I don't have all the things on here, so I can't show you how to do that. So, you know, I guess I just got the main ammo. What's that? What ammo is for this one? So rifle, SMGs. Oh, SMGs. Where's my SMGs? Okay, here's the SMG ammo. Here's the SMG ammo, guys. Um, SMG. What's this? Pistols. 
We get the pistols. Pistols almost the same like the SMG. So, just copy and paste that in there. Was it this sniper rifle ammo? Then you just fit in the sniper rifle ammo. Bam! There we go. We you got your skill tree. You got everything. Uh, and then for weapons, you know, you can delete all of this stuff because why well, you want the beginner stuff, right? I already have all the codes right here, so, you know. You know, it's, you know, let's copy, you know. Let's copy some of these weapons, you know what I'm saying? Get these weapons, bro. Uh, you know, just copy what uh, I don't know how many they are, but and then just paste it in there. One thousand four hundred sixty weapons. You know, oh, two thousand weapons. Say it still says seventy two, right? See that, guys? Click scan all, and everything will be automatically your OP eight. And and this will be all the weapons right here, guys. And then uh, once you're done with the character. Let's go find the game save again. Save it. Click yes. Go back to Brutal Force. You click on this. You do all. Verify. And that's it. And then you just find your where your USB is, is at. Uh, my USB is not in here. So, you know. And then you just drag this and put on the USB. And then you're done. And you have a modded Mechromancer. There we go, guys. That's how you use brute force. See you guys in the next video.